welcome back to my channel. Today I have a small hair care haul for you. It's just going to be real quick. I picked up a few things today while I was out and about and I thought I'd share them with you. The first thing I picked up, it's, it's the Garnier Fructis Hydro Recharge Moisture Whip Leave-In Conditioner. I haven't tried this. I've been looking for a, a new leave-in conditioner, so we'll see um, how it works. Apparently, it's supposed to leave your hair ultra hydrated. Kind of actually really cool. You you know when you get out the, when I when I get out of the shower I'll just take a couple pumps and I'll run it through my hair oh my god that feels really nice and it smells good next product I got was the Tresemme thermal creations this is the heat tamer leave-in spray on damp hair before you blow dry and on your and on dry hair before you curl or flat iron to protect from heat damage so a lot of people on YouTube talk about it so I thought I'd give it a try and see. Next thing I got was this olive oil nourishing sheen spray. This was kind of, I don't want to say it was purchased on a whim because I did research on it last night before I bought it today. I wouldn't say that I have like super damaged hair. My hair is dry. And I don't know if that's because, you know, of the time of year or because I don't really take a lot of time. You know, I don't pay a lot of attention to my hair. So, I, I, you know, I was doing some research last night and I was looking for, you know, how to rejuvenate dry, thirsty hair. And this actually, I came across this on uh, a blog and I thought I would give it a try. I did um, put a little bit of it on the ends just to kind of see how it worked and I did like it you know it kind of gave my hair a little bit of luster so hopefully that's coming off on camera and it didn't make it like sticky or crunchy or weigh it down as you can see you know my curls are still holding up nicely and you know I've I curled my hair about four hours ago before I left to go shopping I, I you know I'm gonna obviously the more I use it I'll, I'll know if I really like it the only thing I can say about it is it does have an interesting, not interesting in like a bad way, it's just an interesting scent to it. The thing about it is once you know it, your hair absorbs it, the scent goes away. So if you're really, you know, if, if, you're, if this is something, you know, you think you might want to try, it does have a scent to it. But like I said, the scent goes away quickly. And it's not a bad scent. It's just kind of interesting. And it hits you in the face real quick. But it goes away. The next item I got was the Tresemme, the Tray 2 Spray, the Extra Firm Control Hairspray, All Day Humidity Resistant. Oh, I sprayed this in my hair before I filmed. And... This stuff is utter perfection. Uh, this was actually a recommendation from Kristen Game. Shopping in a box I'm like, I need a new hairspray. Tell me what I need from the drugstore. And she said, hands down, this was by far her favorite. And I will say, I haven't used, you know, much of it. I put a little bit on before this video and I just sprayed some on now. I like the smell of it. It doesn't make your hair crispy. Yeah, so we'll see. I'm excited to use that. I got this Conair Teasing and Sectioning brush. So we'll see how I see a lot of people use these and I like a lot of volume. So I'm hoping that this does the trick for that. And then I got this Conair Detangling brush. You can use it on wet or dry hair. I plan on using this as a wet brush. The soft bristles aren't supposed to you know, snag or pull the hair. So I thought it, and it says, oh, great for kids hair. Well, if you know me and you, you know, if you know my child, then you know she doesn't have much hair. So mama will be using this. I'll use this when I get out of the shower and comb through my hair first. So I'm excited to use it. Like I said, I'm trying to grow my hair out. So I'm trying to be a little bit better about maintaining it. And last but not least, I got this Garnier Olia Oil Powered Permanent Hair Color. And I got the shade 5.3 Medium Golden Brown. I picked a shade that my cats are going nuts. So
5.3. Um, they had a few shades, you know, lighter. Um, they didn't have anything darker in the fives. I didn't want to go to a four, so I thought this was close to my, my color right now. I'm going to do this tonight and see how it goes if I'm bald in my next video. You know why. So, yeah, those were just a few things I picked up. Um, today while I was out um, grocery shopping and I thought I would give them a try and you know try to do better about <laughs> doing my hair so yeah I'll give those a try and see what I think if you used any of these leave your feedback in the comments below it'll be nice to see you know if I wasted <laughs> any money on any of this so like comment subscribe and I'll see you in my next video bye guys